Hey, Shalom. All praise, glory, and honor be to Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, double unto the other apostles of the great millstone. Salutation to the sincere occupant in the four corners of the earth, preaching the most high's word in sincerity and in truth. Uh, what you see here is a um, guy, Malak Shar, goes by the name of Ataza Wamya, right? And he made a video uh, entitled A War in Kazakh of GMS Mississippi Camp or Proud, Proud Repent. All right. And I'm going I'm going into, into this topic. Um, re reason being is because that north and that south and that east and west jokes, man, that stuff, man, that stuff is lame. It's whack. It has nothing to do with edification because we know that the Most High scattered us to the four corners of the earth, man. The Most High scattered us to the four corners of the earth. And so for, for guys to uplift where they're from and guys to speak down upon from where uh, another brother is, it shows that you're not really a, a true brother, man. Because if anything, you should, 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 should pray for your brother. Be like, Lord, will please hurry up and redeem us from the land of our, our enemies, from the land of our captivities, man. Right? I'm going to play this clip right here. And, 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 and it's rude. It's disrespectful. Hey, because if I believe that a man is, is a man of the Lord, no matter where he is, I don't talk about where he's from. I don't make uh, 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 jokes about where he's from, man. You know? So without further ado, I'm going to play this clip right here. Right. Proverbs 14 and 15. The simple believe of every word. But the prudent man looketh well to his goings. Right. You think I'm simple? You understand? When I sit there and I watch any person that's claiming that they're teaching Israel, I pause the video whenever they say a scripture. I go and look up that scripture to see if they're using it in the proper context. You understand? No, you don't understand. You understand? But it's cool. You know. I ain't gonna get that worked up over y'all, cause y'all, you are in Mississippi, you understand? And niggas are mad simple in Mississippi and lazy, you understand? So, you know, hey, stop being fucking lazy, stop being gullible, and if you say you're a man of prudence, go look up the words, man. And that goes for anybody. Don't come on my comment board flooding it up with, with nonsense, cause you will get basically ignored, you understand? With that, I say shalom. You know, so so that was pretty much the clip right there. But but I'm bringing this out for edification because you have some guys that that uplift their geographical location, whether they stay in a in a major city or where they stay in in uh, ocean front or, or you know where they stay in a popular a popular area. But the Most High is not dealing with that, man. All right, the Most High is not dealing with that at all. I'm going to start right here with the book of Psalms, chapter 44, verse 11. Thou hast given us like sheep appointed for meat, and hast scattered us among the heathen. Thou sellest thy people for naught, and dost not increase thy wealth by their price. Thou makest us a reproach to our neighbors, a scorn and a derision to them that are round about us. So no matter where we are, man, the Most High had made, made us a derision and a reproach to them that are round about us, man. And then to even understand the whole concept of that north and that south where the jokes it, it, uh, come into play, that goes back into the into the civil wars, man. It goes back into the, the 1800 and during the times of, of of the Yankees, they come against the rebels of the south, man. So 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 your mind frame was programmed inside of you by Esau. Esau gave you those thoughts, man. Esau told you to hate your brother. It goes back to 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 to, to Willie Lynch. It goes back to Jim Crow. Right. And then ultimately it goes back to those curses, man. All right. And I got this right here from the League of the South dot com. It says the demonization of the South did not begin, as some may think, with the civil rights movement of the 1950s and 1960s, though it did take on a particularly hostile tone during those decades. Rather, the campaign to portray the South as the sole blot on an otherwise pure and shining city on a hill began in the 1830s with the rise of the Yankee reformists, man. So the whole concept, the whole concept of, 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 um, of coming against the South, that there was talk. You were taught to, to, to think that way. And not only, and not only that, the roots of, 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 of a great majority of individuals spring forth from the South, man. 
Now, I don't give a good god dog about the South. I don't give a, nothing about the North, East, or South, or West. You, you, and you want to know why? Because th this is not my home, man. This is not. It, 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 this is not my home. This is where I want to want to return to, man. This is where I want to go back to. All right. This place is gonna be destroyed. So if you uplifting the hood, if you uplifting the suburbs, if you uplifting the country, and the Most High is not dealing with that, man. It could because if your love resides here, if your love resides here, then you are gonna die with this place, man. You know, and 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 that was basically just blatant blatant disrespect on your behalf, man. That was just a, a blatant disrespect, right? A war in Kazaka, GS, GMS Mississippi camp are proud. Repent, and then you threw in the so, a threw in the jab. When I sit there and I watch any person that's claiming that they're teaching Israel, I pause the video whenever they say a scripture. I go and look up that scripture to see if they're using it in the proper context. You understand? No, you don't understand. You understand, but it's cool. You know, I ain't gonna get that worked up over y'all because y'all, you are in Mississippi. You understand? And niggas are mad simple in Mississippi. And, and niggas are mad simple everywhere. And niggas are definitely mad simple here in Mississippi. And and but but you know you want you know you want you want to know one thing. There's faith here in Mississippi. There are men of the Lord here in Mississippi. And for you to make that statement against men of the Lord, maybe you should go back to your video and look at this word right here. Maybe you should look at that word right there, man. Because 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 men of the most high are in Mississippi, man. And, and 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 for you to to have a, a disdain or a complete disregard for, for this bullcrap state, you, it, that should be more the merit to praise the Most High. Oh man, the Most High woke up guys in Mississippi, because when people look at Mississippi, the only thing they can think of is Emmett Till. They think of Mississippi burning. They can only think of of Jake hanging from a tree. Why? Because of the music, because of of, of TV, because of the educational books. I mean, that's why. The majority of people who speak against uh, different geographical locations have never been there, had never passed through there, had never done research about about those places, man. You know. But ultimately, it goes back to uh, Deuteronomy twenty-eight verse fifty-four, so that the man that is tender among you and very delicate, his eyes shall be evil toward his brother and toward the wife of his bosom and toward the remnant of his children which he shall leave. Now we know that you've already that, that you have plenty of problems with brethren. You have a lot of problems with order. You got a lot of problems a, 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 with guys, with um, with your fellow brethren, man. That's what you really have a problem with. Because when you look at your page, your whole thing is 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 trying to rebuke men of great millstone because you're no longer the fold. Now and, and now you're solo dolo and you got something to prove. Well, we I didn't want me around y'all, so. I'm gonna come against all y'all. If you don't, if if you don't want me to make a video about you, then just don't, just get the scriptures right. Like no, nah, man, you coming in another way, man. You coming in sideways, man. You coming in uh, trying to pretend like that you're here to to exhort brothers and rebuke brothers and uplift brothers, but you basically, you're basically a, 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 a getting a kick and a thrill out of coming against men, a man of great millstone, and ultimately a, a man of the most high, man. And then you go you go to your page, man. You got likes uh, a, a from Avengers of Yahweh shot, man. You got likes from this from this a uh, 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 reject, man. So 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 that proves what you're about. And then not not only that, I'm gonna go back to the um back to the video, right? And then I'm gonna jump down to the comment section because uh, the brother GMS Shar Amat Ba was uh, basically going into your topic getting to the bottom of it trying to give you better understanding upon things and you basically end up cursing the brother out man all right 14 hours later after his comment you, you came in and said i never taught that bullshit them reprobates are teaching aka you're talking about shy uh, shy uh, tr tried and refined right i never taught that bullshit them reprobates are teaching about the angels nor would i you should ask before making prejudgment of me or what I teach. And is that not what you just did here? Is that not what you just did? So, so now you've been an, an open hypocrite, man. You want somebody to, to sit back and examine you before they put a comment on your on, on your page. But you go out and make a, 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 um, 
a 13, 14 minute video on other brothers, man. So you're a hypocrite, man. You should ask before making prejudgment of me or what I teach. I know that 2 Peter 2 and Jude is speaking about false teachers and ungodly men that come into the truth to be condemned. So tell your group that so they'll get out of their feelings and deal with the scriptures like men. Now it's your group, you know, so so the proof is in the pudding, man. Hey, you ain't right, man. You ain't right. So so if 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 you if you love the most high, you love his son, just continue to do his work then, man. You know? Because because the way the way it seems, it seems like that you got something to prove. Because because you don't you don't want to be in that category of one of the fallouts, man. You know? Because you do have a problem with order, man. And then then going back into the whole little South ordeal, making jokes about the South, like, dude, what do you think North and South Carolina is, man? This is a, 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 a from Mississippi. You know, you're teaching in, in Fort Mill, South Carolina. You and you were originally uh, in, in Charlotte, North Carolina, man. So you're right there on that border there, man. Like nobody cares, bro. Like nobody cares. Like this is this is a joke, man. The election, the, the, the election is Tuesday. Hillary can get in there and, 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 and things can change. Trump can get in there and things can change, man. Things are going to change. All right, this is from www.finalcall.com. It's an excerpt I highlighted. It says, for example, if you put a slave in a hog pen and train him to live there and incorporate in him to value it as a way of life completely, and that's what guys do with what? The ghettos, with the hoods, with the suburbs, with the highly populated cities. That's what they do. They extol and exalt it, man. You know? For example, if you put a slave in a hog pen and train him to live there and incorporate in him to value it as a way of life completely, the biggest problem you would have out of him is that he would worry you about provisions to keep the hog pen clean. And is that not what our people do? We need somebody to fix these roads. We need somebody to, 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 to repair these bridges. You cry out for a, 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 a for, for for your oppressor. To give you a more comfortable situation, man. Well, you guys, where you, where you are in Mississippi. Man, you, right, man. Who cares, man? Hey, because I'm going to say this, man. I had to write it down. Because because I've been to New York. I've been to Connecticut. I've been to Chicago. I've been to Iowa. I've been to Tennessee. I've been to North Carolina, South Carolina. I've been to Alabama. I've been to Florida. I've been to St. Louis. I've been to Indiana. I've been to Texas. And guess what I saw there? The same thing. People... In the north of those states, despise the people from the south. The people that, that stay along the front frontier or the border despise the people that live on the inner city. And guess who those people are? Israelites. Now, outside the U.S., right? I've been to Mexico. All right, the brother that you spoke of, Kazakh, has been to Puerto Rico. He's been to Guatemala. The brother of war has been to the Dominican Republic. All right, I've been to Austria, Germany, the Czech Republic, Hungary. I've been to all these different areas. And it's the same ordeal, man. The people, the people speak against. Uh, um, uh, let's say if you live in the inner city, the people that that, that live in the countryside a, will call you a city slicker, or the people, the people that, that that live on the coast, they have a term for them. They call them coastanians. Oh, man, they talk. Oh, they talk like savages, or they or they have a different dialect. Whether it's a different dialect of English, a different dialect of Spanish, it don't matter, man. It goes back to the curses, man. So, so for example, if you put a slave in a hog pen and train him to live there and incorporate him to value it as a way of life completely, the biggest problem you will have out of him is that he will worry you about provisions to keep the hog pen clean. It goes to my next scripture, Micah chapter 2, verse 10. Arise ye and depart, for this is not your rest, because it is polluted. It shall destroy you even with a sore destruction. Now, where is the Most High's elect? The Most High's elect is scattered throughout the four corners of the earth, man. Now, your whole or ordeal is is to 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 uh, so-called rebuke and 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 teach people the proper way to go. But weren't you once a member with us, man? Once you weren't you once a head of a camp? So how, how how do you all of a sudden have all the answers? But while you was amongst us, 
Look at you now. You're a castaway. You're an outsider. You picking in through the blinds. You try to pry the back door in. You know, try to pry the back door open. Try to gain interest once again, man. Just do the work, man. Just do the work and be quiet, man. Like nobody's looking for you, man. Nobody. First Corinthians 9 and 27. But I keep under my body and bring it into subjection, lest that by any means when I have preached to others, I myself should be a castaway. But Mr. King Prince has all the answers right now, man. He has all the answers. GMS line, line of Judah, Baltimore. Then you got your street videos. Then you're going, you're going into something else, answering, so-called answering some clarification from a history of Yaiqua. Everybody that you pretty much deal, they're dealing with, I'm not dealing with that dude, King of the Diet, but the, the, the majority of the people that you deal with are, are, are great millstone members. You, you just can't let go, man. You just can't let go. All right. Hey, so with that, hey, hey, that's all I got for right now. Um, I just had to to, to do that because because th that whole South joke thing, man. Man, this stuff is man. This stuff is is like the brother Yasha Wama said. Man, it's just tacky, man. Like like nobody's even even looking for that anymore. When the internet is gone, when martial law is implemented. When the cities of the when the walls of the cities are put up and you can't go in and go out, who's gonna be worried about what's happening in Mississippi? Who's gonna be worried about what's happening in Canada, in Florida, in Cali? Nobody is gonna care because every man is gonna be looking out for his own self, man. You know? So with that, I'll praise Lord and honor be to you. How about Shemi Howashai? Lord, where the application was made. Until next time, shalom.